Outrage continues in the US and all around the world, triggered by the death of George Floyd and many others before him. Such police brutality has uncovered how ugly systemic racism has become, especially anti-black racism. But what is systemic racism? Let's look at it from today's context. This event was only the tip of the iceberg. We as a society have internalized prejudice against the black minority because of what we see in their communities. Poverty, crime, high incarceration rates, and low economic success. This in turn influences our public policies and practices at the institutional level, leading to biased criminal justice systems, inadequate access to healthcare, less education, more predatory loans from banks, and poor housing conditions, giving birth to a vicious cycle that feeds into the inequities black communities face our prejudice, discrimination, and consequently, the brutal police practices we see today. This is what systemic racism looks like on the ground. But police brutality is only one product of many. So focusing only on the police system can take away from our potential to introduce meaningful change. Ignorance is the enemy right now. We need to educate ourselves on these matters to address the prejudice we have internalized over the decades and how it influences institutional policies and practices. For more information, feel free to listen to our podcast link below. This was a one minute insight. See you in the next one.